I was open, uh, opening the doors, 5am, I thought to myself, wow, it's quite quiet for 5am, well, not to worry, got things to do, open the door, it about half an hour before anything picked up, I mean, it was just me, me and one other person behind Till, which was a barista, and then this lunatic pedaled in on his bike, full, genuinely into the shop, screeched to a halt and shouted, Davida! Matt was the name of the barista. <coughs> Davida looked around, bewildered, and this man, like, ran up to the counter right in my face. He's like, this man, this man here makes the best espressos in the whole company. I'm like, bearing in mind, Lewis, picking an espresso, you click a button on the machine, right? It's not like he's hand grinding the coffee beans, right? So, fucking lunar. And I found out he was there last week as well, and he insulted quite a few members of staff because he said their uh, their espressos were shite while Davida's was not. Um, again, it's just clicking a button. Davida was like, I had the impression that these two were close friends. Um, Davida like, was like, how does this man know my name? I was like, are you guys not friends? I was like, he was here last week and he was weird, but he loved my espresso. I, but I didn't tell him my name. <laughs> then, so he somehow found out Davida's name. So this man was just like, Davida gave him his espresso on hot water. That I don't know why he needed hot water. Um, in, in his wee cup. And Davida was like, oh, I'll give it to you on the house. I'll give it to you on the house. And this man was like, absolutely not. I need to give you something if you're giving me something for free. And then he was like, I work on roofs. I've got a question for you both. Why do they use copper nails? I was like, oh, I, honestly, I couldn't tell you. Well, my boys. Uh, oh, no. He looked, yeah, he said, well, my boys, I'll be giving you both a copper nail. And no, no fucking joke. He pulled out of his wallet and handed Davida a copper nail. And da he just took, he just looked at me and looked at the girl. and said, oh, thank you very much. Very kind of you. I didn't get a copper nail. Um, I was perfectly fine with that because I didn't, I don't, I don't think my tetanus jab would have kept me alive. A few minutes later, this man came back to the counter. He was like, I'm really sorry. I feel really bad. I didn't give you anything. I was like, no, 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 you don't need to feel bad. I told you, I, I was like, you know, I just didn't want the lunatic talking to me in all honesty. He was like, here, have this sticker. Genuinely have this sticker, but don't put it on your skin because it will poison you. And I was like, I, I, what? And he was like, it's not for skin. And like, I looked at it, it was this massive sticker of a monkey licking out its own asshole for some cartoon. <laughs> genuinely, genuinely. We, we, gen <laughs> I should have taken a photo of it. Um, and I was like, <laughs> no, I've been there immediately because after he said it will poison you, I took it, I took it in the back and the, the hot chef was like, what, what did they just say to you? I was like, I was told not to put it on my skin because it would poison me. And, he, and she was like, do you think that's LSD? I was like, oh, why did you have to go and say that? Anyway, so I was like, I threw it into the bin because I was like, am I fuck risking my sorry ass for this? Um, so I threw it into the bin. I was, I was then told that this guy had started to become a regular. No one really liked him. This, now this was a strange, when, when he was leaving, um, he had his earphones in and I could hear his music. Some... I don't know what he was listening to. It sounded bizarre. Then he like shouted at me over his music. Your music, shite! I was like, oh, okay. And then he just walked out. And look, Lewis, I genuinely thought I was going to be experiencing a high for a while. Uh, I thought I was going to be riding that. But it was just so weird. Just like giving someone a copper nail and <laughs> a sticker that will poison you. He works on roofs, so you would fucking know. You would hope he knows. Why they use copper nails? Not asking a couple of twats in a coffee shop why they use them. Anyway, so that was that lunatic story. Oh, I hope he never comes back. But from what I understand, it sounds like he will. Because Davita has the best expressos in the company. Fucking copper nail. Let me give you this copper nail. What? <laughs> the more I think about it, the more unacceptable that is. Just taking out of your wallet. First of all, a copper nail. Did you just did you just rip that off some poor family's house? <laughs> I think this is a, an ornament. <laughs> this was to remember the most <laughs> I like the idea of some These shingles like... were especially close to me, so I took a nail I like to the remember. Idea of some 
family just like, and how much do we owe you? Not to worry, I've taken that upon myself. <laughs> I've taken all of your copper nails out of your roof. Consider it payment. Close the door too hard and they slide off the roof. <laughs> and then he's just turning around. Ah, you see what you need there? You need some good copper nails. <laughs> do you know why they have copper nails on roofs? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking lunatic. Did he look like a psycho? Yes, he came right. So, I, as far as I'm aware, he's British, right? But he was wearing this Australian headband covering his hair. Um, he had glasses. Like I said, he came cycling. <laughs> his bike didn't look road legal. Now, bikes don't need to be road legal, but this thing, oh, that, you know what, that? It needed a few copper nails, Lewis, to hold it together. That's what it needed. <laughs> what is a roofer doing up at half five in the morning? He's collecting copper nails <laughs> for his travels. I, I like the idea of him just uh, finding, just seeing like a glint of copper on the ground. It's like, a copper <gasps> nail? It's my. Ah, oh, it's only a fucking two pence. Imagine having room for Christmas. Everyone gets the same fucking present. <laughs> just a copper nail and an espresso. <laughs> or even worse, a fucking sticker that will kill you. <laughs> and everyone like plays on the illusion that they don't know what it's going to be. Oh, what could it be? Oh, oh, it's another copper nail like last year. You shouldn't have. We all know <laughs> copper nails. <laughs> <laughs>